Okay, I decided to go back and do some more testing. Uh, this is a different motherboard, and since the the NJM N64 amp is kind of tied up with uh, the other board, I just went back to using the NCS 2553 RGB as an amplifier. And interestingly enough, the glitch does not happen with this board. I'll try to die here real quick. <clears throat> Look, the ME is there, the ED is not in a different color. So it's it's something specific to this board. Oh, and I do not have uh, any cat on the RGB PPU. Um, okay, same board. Super Mario Brothers Duck Hunt. Again, it is not there. But I'll run over to 1 2 again. I think it was right there where we were seeing it before, and it's perfectly okay right now. So let's test power pack. And nothing. Wait. Yeah. Okay, maybe it needs the cap for this. Okay, so I have uh, an 82 picofarad cap on the RGB PPU between pins 24 and 20. Um, just a quick check. Do not see the problem with Super Mario Brothers. Let's see if it's with. I'm just seeing if it changes anything. Looks like we're still good there. But we still do not have power pack compatibility. Okay, for this test, the only thing that I've changed is the 373. I changed it from an LS to an HC, and as you can see, it works now. Let's check the uh, jail bars on Abadox. And wow, it looks way better for some reason. There is zero glitches like on the other motherboard. So I've definitely got something, something else I need to look at. And the one thing that I can think of is the SRAM. Uh, the motherboard that's giving me all the problems has newer SRAM chips on it. Yeah, it was definitely uh, giving me much more fits 
with the other motherboard. Even by this point, I would have been seeing a lot of glitches on the stars. Uh, even the enemies seem to glitch off screen and all kinds of crazy stuff was happening. Anyway, it seems to be working. Although I think my uh, I think my reset cap needs to be replaced. That's a really good sign. The reset cap is bad. It's just this tiny little one microfarad cap right out here up front next to the reset button. If you uh, hit the power and it goes to that, and reset makes it boot, then it's most likely that cap is bad. Okay, so let's try the SCART to YUV or component. Converter, got the power pack on the let's see on the LCD. Go to Abidox real quick just to see what the jail bars look like. <laughs> it looks so flawless. It's crazy. It looks a lot different though. The colors are different. But the only jail bars I see are just the ones that are always on that TV. Okay, so the big problem that I was seeing was Zelda. Let's see if that's still there. Okay, not seeing anything on the top of the screen yet, which it was, it was well, actually I am a little bit. Crap. Yep, yep, it's going nuts again. Okay, I paused it. Most evident right in this area, yeah. Not sure what's causing that. Let's see if I can start this back up. Oh yeah. It goes real nuts when changing screens. So it's not the fact that it didn't have a cap on the RGB PPU, because it's still doing it. But, just for shits and gigs, let's try some other caps. Okay, here's with a 470 picofarad cap, and the whole top of the screen has just went nuts. Okay, and now I'm way back down to a 15 picofarad cap uh, on the entry screen. It's almost completely fine. Uh, right one, nothing, and then just fail. You know, that's terrible. Not sure why. Something I should note is this is sync, green, and blue only. And it's flawless. It's only when I add the output capacitor to red that it goes nuts so I'm gonna try no capacitors on the out okay uh, it's good it's perfect this is a uh, let me get you zoomed out here a little bit this is RGB SCART to com to a component converter and the only thing I've changed is there are no capacitors on the output of the RGB amp 
and it's the NCS 2553 amp. Completely flawless. There are no issues on the top of the screen like I was getting when I had the caps on the output. So now let's try the power pack again. Okay. Power pack. Go down to Abidox again, just for fun. Yep. Super. It's working like it should. Excellent. Good news.